hi guys it's from Miss Sebastian here again okay guys it's another wonderful Wednesday and today we are gonna be learning the best keywords to search for most of your favorite design elements most time when you see designs and you see all these elements you actually don't know the right name to search for them okay so we are gonna explore this the name actual name to get it as quick as possible you might know some but won't give you exact element you're looking for that fast okay so we we'll exploit all these elements and they are perfect names to get them exact as what you are looking for okay guys without further ado let's get started so guys here am i in my browser and we are gonna be exploring all these things here so i'm gonna be typing them and showing you guys practical example of how to go about it so the first one is brush stroke so let me just type brush stroke Okay, so guys this is it okay i'm sure you might be looking for a whole a lot of these on to use on your design probably you might be typing something like splash or some kind of funny names okay so guys the actual name for this truck that i use it on my design is some people use it on their design probably as names or dates uh, placeholders okay the proper name to use to search for them is called brush stroke so whenever you need something like this you just head over to your browser and type brush strokes png so you will get something nice that you can download from you can get free free site where you can download them from you see all these sites okay okay the next one is um called uh plastic wrap plastic wrap okay most times you're gonna see um on designs some kind of nylon effect or shiny background effect shiny background effect they are called plastic wrap let me just type it plastic wrap png png download once you are searching for element you need for design don't just put it png download i brush through png download okay so these are these these are it now all these nylon effect you see on designs that people use they are called plastic wrap okay so should in case you want to use them on your design and you don't know what to search for it it's called plastic wrap okay you can see examples now and this site is on blast and this other site is raw pezo and this is png true okay so guys this is opera menu probably if you're on chrome you will get a better um presentations of this whole uh, search result so that you can easily navigate here okay so this is a primary i'm using now okay so here is it plastic wrap that is what this one is used for this nylon effect should in case you want to use it on your designs okay the next is the next is ton paper png paper make sure to put png download whenever you are typing anyone so it just gets you the png and it gets you a download uh, site a uh, site with this download icon where you can easily download it. because without the download you just bring up sites probably they will they won't give you a download button so you have to start navigating again but once there is download you can easily and navigate okay so guys this is the tom paper png they are what i use them on my designs they are more like a, a shape divider but they look like tom peppers okay you might be searching for probably scratch or some kind of funny names okay the actual name to get them is tom paper and do uh, learn how to switch to images whenever you're searching for elements so don't always leave them in all as a designer you should know how to switch to images here in images here you see all the whole stuff you're looking for instead of in all okay i use it a lot as a designer you should learn how to use the image version of whatever search engine you just from all you switch to image you see i'm on images now and look at a whole lot of thumb papers these are i use them on most of my designs okay so they are more like a shape divider but they have this natural look you know i do tell people if you want to be as creative as possible try to imitate nature in your designs they are always awesome when people see um, realistic stuff trying to be uh, maneuvered on designs, you know. Okay, so guys, the fourth one now is, is you remember when you see all these designs with some kind of scratch on them, you know, this kind of scratch, scratch. Okay, it's called grunge effect, grunge effect. So that's the actual name for this. Okay, so I'm giving you this uh, name so you don't have to start wondering on what to search. Grunge effect PNG. Let's put PNG as we are supposed to put png download so you get an easy download icon or download menu download so click search now so you see these are the grunge effect here you see 
these are the dusty effect you see on people, people's design they are called grunge effect that's the actual name i'm think probably you might be searching for some other stuff to use on to get them okay they're actually called grunge effect so with this now we can you see this is kind png is a free png site and this is also free PNG site. So these are a whole lot of grunge effect I can use on my design. Then if you want them transparent, probably you don't want the background, you want transparent. The one you can place on, you can put transparent grudge effect PNG download. You type it there and you're gonna get transparent one. Okay, so guys, we are going over the next one. The next one is um you remember when you see some of these uh grunge effect also, but they are actually not looking that this grunge effect because they don't have much of um much of all these uh grunge uh effect texture of them they are just simple but they still have some little scratches or something okay they are called dust effect png okay just make dust effect png just make sure it tra it's transparent those effects png uh download download then you put transparent because you enjoy it when it's transparent okay using it as a background you might not get something interesting just those png uh, download then you put transparent transparent so we then search okay we are still in our image version let's see what we get you see this time around is grunge effect but it doesn't it's not that much it's more like the grunge effect but this one is a lesser version this one doesn't have too much scratches or too much distractions on it so if you just need little scratches you use dust effect to look for them you see i have all of this and you see this kind png now is a site for free element okay they don't you don't have to pay anything you see all these ones and you see sick png is also a free png site png item is also a free png uh, uh, site look at this png item again nice png so it's a free png site okay so guys these are dust effect okay if you don't need look at this one also top png you can download it it's also a free png site and this is transparent so you can just download this and place it on your design you can then change the color okay guys these are always nice you know it's always easy when you just know what to search and not going about uh playing around with keywords okay you hit the nail on the head and you you save a whole lot of time there okay the next is uh probably this instagram effect more like instagram like effect you see and they are on motions some of them are on motion it's also oh cool if you can download them one one and then use uh, an application to add motion to them but it's better if you just get exactly what you're looking for so the keyword the exact keyword for that is insta hat um insta hat insta hat motion blur insta hat motion blur so you have insta hat motion blur you type so look at it here so remember always put png and you put download so you get a straight download icon i just i didn't put the png there so let me go back i didn't put the png so look at it here and you see they are all in motion now so and this is png find is a free png site okay so these are the what is the keyword to hit the nail on the head on this um, element okay so these are interesting insta hat um pngs here so you can just download them right away okay the next one is a uh, um a whole lot of people uh recently started using it on their design it's good to follow trend as a designer but don't just overdo things okay just make your make yourself unique so this is 3d love emoji d love emoji png download okay so guys look at it I, I, I most a whole lot of people use this on their design okay so this is not on motion it's not motion blur because it's actually nice when it's on motion blur because it looks as if it's in motion is flying so you can use photo room for those that don't know you use photo room to blow whatever stuff you want to blow so you can use photo room to blow it like the one i use for this um this tutorial thumbnail you can see is blood so i use photo room to blow it and then you can use it on your so you see this is um a free png site you see this similar png is a free png site this one is nice also and it's then free png site also people use this one also and this is png tree you can you have only i think they used to give a grace of two downloads per day okay so if you're just signing into uh png tree you just sign up uh, they will give you a grace of two download button
second to last one is so uh, type it in now pro tropical leaves and you remember all these coconut looking leaves and more like a tropical looking leaves a whole lot of them so the best word for them is tropical leaves png so you can put download i told you guys so look at it now there's a whole lot of stuff this one now is a free from a free png side this is a from a free png side so you see a whole lot of them so the best keyword to search for this is called tropical leaves png so you get a whole lot of them instead of going to search for palm tree i think people will be searching for funny stuff trust me a whole lot of people will be searching for funny stuff so this is the right keyword to get the exact of what you're looking for you see many varieties and they are all looking nice okay so this is the keyword to look for leaves like this in case should in case you want all these nice leaves you see I have a whole lot of varieties here which are all looking nice okay guys this is a, a keyword then the last one is called um grain effect it's more like this grunge effect also but this one is still not that much more like also the dust effect we checked earlier but this one is not that much also it just has little effect it's showing but not that much so no much scratches on this one so grain so i don't know anyone will be okay for you. you would want to get a pen and then you write down all these keywords because you might actually forget them or probably is here on my channel so should in case you forget them anytime you just head over here you take um you view some of them so you record the names you can you can then head over back to your site and search for what you're looking for so grain texture background so you can put png you can put background white background you can put blue background so anyone so let's just click the search button you see this is a grain texture so you can put grain texture blue background grain, grain texture white background okay so this is more like it's also called noise effect so if you don't want to use noise you can just use grain texture okay guys these are the eight um keywords for some kind of frequent design elements that most people would want to know the name okay so this is gonna save you a whole lot of stress of number one looking for uh looking for someone to take the design element from where you can just get from google and number two uh, keeps you on top of your game because you you are actually you can actually get them at your frequent probably should in case you lose any of them you can just head over and get them right away okay okay guys thanks for watching this awesome tutorial should in case you enjoyed watching this video don't forget to hit the like hit the subscribe button and don't forget to share this video as you are not the only one meant to enjoy this awesome video okay guys don't forget keep creating and i'll see you next wednesday